Greetings and salutations, YouTube land. Preval back again with another of my famous unboxing videos. Today I have a recurring theme on my channel. The latest box from Pro Wrestling Loot. I gotta be honest, I don't remember all the featured stars in this one. I want to say it was TJ Perkins, Victoria, somebody else. I don't remember who the last one was. Uh, it should feature the next of the pint-sized All-Stars, and after the success of the rare blue ones last time, they've added an even more rare gold one in. I think the blues are like 25 total, the golds are like 10. So let's see if I managed to get one of the chases. Spoiler ahead of time, I probably didn't. I know my luck. All right. Let's get ready for the unboxing. Chop, thank you. So this should have at least an autograph photo. I don't remember if they said anything else other than the micro brawler. Not, I'm sorry, not micro brawler, pint size all star. I keep making that mistake. All right, let's see what I got. Oh, looks like we got a t-shirt this month. The t-shirts are always hit or miss, so we'll see. Some of them I really like, some of them I don't. So at least looks like it has a neat design. And it's... Pro Wrestling Fan, Support Wrestling, now more than ever. Okay, this is a sentiment I definitely get behind, and it's really freaking cool. I like this shirt a lot. With all the promotions and wrestlers struggling right now, we got to do whatever we can as fans to support them. If you're in any sort of shape, buy some merch, you know, uh, attend like the internet pay-per-views if your internet provider doesn't suck like mine does. Do what you can. All right. Up next, let's see. I feel the pint size all-star. All right, let's see. Is it gold? Nope. It's a regular one again. And it's TJ Perkins. I gotta be honest, I'm not familiar with TJ Perkins. I don't know much about him at all. If you know anything, please shoot me a comment down below. Let me know who he is. See, not a lot in this box, actually. We're already at the... Wow, oh, well, here's the pin. And we got... Ah, Paul London. That was the other featured one. Guess we know who the auto is. I actually, I really liked Paul London in uh, Lucha Underground. He did the Rabbit Tribe character that was absolutely freaking bonkers. I would have loved to have seen them do some more with that. I was actually hoping the autograph was him as that uh, character because I really liked it. And last but not least, we have the autograph. First up, the trading card. Hmm, I got two authenticity. That's interesting. Voice of a Generation, a.k.a. Howard Finkel. Very awesome re-announcer. I'm curious, is there more than one photo in here? All right, you ready? Pretty sure we know who it is, but let's check it out. That is not Victoria. I think it's a luchador. I don't recognize, though. Definitely feel like it's someone I'd like, though. Let's see what the cheat sheet has to say. Wait. Aha! There was a second one hidden in there. We did get Victoria. Surprise! That's right, there was supposed to be a bonus one last month, and they weren't able to get it in, so they put it in this month. Sorry. 
I've been doing some crazy hours. I can't remember everything. So there's the nice one of Victoria. And of the guy that I don't recall the name of. Here is the spoiler sheet. Featuring autographed 8x10, personally signed by Victoria. Oops, there's actually a misprint on here. Uh, they list the, uh, okay, it's Beastia666 is the other photo. I don't know him, but he really looks up my alley. The TJ Perkins line, along with the gold and blue variants, which I didn't hit. The Paul London lapel pin and the trading card. This box is only like 25 bucks a month, so it's a really, really good deal. Usually get some pretty nice stuff, especially this month with the two autographs. Really cannot complain about that at all. And that t-shirt that is going to get a lot of wear. So that's this month's Pro Wrestling Loot. There'll be a link down below if you want to subscribe. If you're a wrestling fan, I highly recommend it. Um, I know next month is supposed to have a Lucha mask. Um, I'm trying to remember. I think just announced it the other day. Is it on the card, maybe? No, that'd be useful. I don't remember the featured uh, people. I want to say... I think uh, Juventud Guerrera is one of them. I don't remember the others. Hopefully the Lucha Mask is Hoovy. That would be awesome. He had a really cool mask. I'm not expecting it to be because this would be rather expensive to do, but fingers crossed. Speaking of masks, you may see I have some on display. Yes, after 18 years of marriage, my wife finally gave in and got me some little heads. I'm racking up the face palms, folks. All right. Any comments, give them to me down below if you recognized anybody I don't. Shoot me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Ding that bell to be annoyed whenever one of my videos goes live. And if you haven't yet, hit that subscribe button so you get all of them. As always, be excellent to each other. Party on, dudes!